Yo! What's good, Black, Angry, and Educated? Happy 4th of July. Happy Canada Day. We out here, we lit. I'm about to go to this day party, but you know how to let off a little steam right quick. So, Amelia Clark, how in the fuck did you think you've ever experienced racism? So, I'm, I don't, I'm confused. Maybe by, by slaying all those dragons in Game of Thrones, did you all of a sudden think that you were black or something? Like, what the fuck happened? What the fuck was going through your head? And let's see your reasoning for this. Let's break it down. Let's go to the quotes. There's fewer women on the set and we may have less lines. Sometimes I'm the only one there and I may not even have a lead. So you just equated your two million motherfucking dollar salary for every fucking episode of Game of Thrones when you run around with the motherfucking dragons and freeing slaves and you think you experiencing racism. Oh wait, I'ma pause. What the fuck is going through your head? Just because you're running around as Khaleesi with dragons freeing slaves, that don't mean you experience racism. What the fuck? You can't equate what you're doing on the movie theater to what's going on in real life. That shit ain't never been the case. Bitch, you make two million dollars every motherfucking episode. The hell is wrong with you? On top of the fact that you have to worry about getting died, you have to worry about dying every day, you have to worry about how your hair looks to go to work, you have to worry about your son coming home safely, you have to worry about the fact that you have 80 times, 82 times more wealth than black people as soon as you come out the womb, and I'm sure more is every, than everybody else in the country. So, um... Yeah, well, you don't want to have the powers of Wakanda come to your front door, you know what I'm saying, since we're going to be on the superhero shit, and you think you're in a fantasy, you know what's going to happen? Wakanda going to come to your ass, and Black Panther going to be, going to be doing flips, flips and shit, slaying the motherfucking dragons. He going to bring them dragons' heads to your motherfucking front door, and you're going to be like, God damn, my dragons are dead. Yeah, Khaleesi, winter is here. In the form of black motherfucking panther. I'm taking this motherfucker over, goddammit. And then you know what? Then his princess is gonna make you her slave. And then, only then, will you have experienced racism, goddammit. And what the fuck is this with white women being on such a goddamn roll between the Jenners? Emily Clark between Sophia Coppola. And the motherfucking Paris man talking about black feminists can't meet. And Sophia just wanna take black people out of a fucking movie about slavery. And the Jenners just stealing everything that's fucking black and appropriating the fuck out of their whole damn lives. And Miley's saying, I don't wanna be part of black culture anymore. And then you got the motherfucking white women going to the Supreme Court talking about we don't get no affirmative action when affirmative action is benefiting white women more than anybody else. Then you take your dumb ass to the poll and vote for motherfucking Trump. Can the non woke fucking stupid ones have a meeting and gather together and think about all of the things they've been complicit in as far as slavery, Jim Crow, everything else, and the oppression of people of color in general? Maybe then we can solve some motherfucking problems. But shout out to all my real white women. Somebody just needs to animate one of the motherfucking memes of them and just put black culture. <laughs> fucking idiots. The hell is wrong with her? Racism? I guess fairies and fairy dust are real too, goddamn.